Well, YouTube, welcome back to another episode of Lifeless Planet. You guys remember from the last episode, we've been chasing her for a while. And we ended up with her on top of these power lines, which I'm not sure if I'm supposed to go up there and get her. Or she's going to end up running across those lines and I'll be following her on the ground. I'm going to assume it's the latter. So we'll go ahead and get started and see what crazy shenanigans these Ruskies have been doing on this planet. And whether or not it's all in our head, or we're actually on some strange, lifeless planet. that like we've already been there already this is this is getting creepy and weird all right let's get to it <clears throat> oh, that's a radio tower you still up there what's happening Still up there. Can't go down there, I'll die. Am I supposed to go this way? Looks like we're going this way. Can I climb up on this? Might be a mistake. Something red and glowy over there. That's never a good sign. Ow. No. Did we go somewhere we weren't supposed to? Something flat blinking down there. Really hope this is where we're supposed to go. This. Initial analysis indicates a mandine or pro pyro garnets in a mica schist. Typical minerals form deep underground at high, very high pressure. If confirmed, this suggests active planet tectonic activity active plate tectonic activity in this planet's crust which could contribute to the environment more hospitable for life interesting so i guess we're going the right way i guess we're not chasing that woman anymore either all right so it looks like we're going to have to play leapfrog well not really oh no please don't okay we made it across Oh, there she is. I knew it. She's walking on the power lines. Look at that. There she is. I don't know if that actually worked. I don't think it did. Oh! That's my first time dying in this game. What happens? Really? Okay. Okay, apparently something invisible there. Oh, uh, I guess we could do this. I don't know why he's so willing to just wander off into this planet like this. We found like a civilization. Well, at least we could survive here until, well, maybe there isn't any more answers. But we didn't even try to go inside the houses. to go down that way uh, I'm gonna say no to that guess we're gonna get over there somehow Can I make it up there nope Oh wait, look, there's another building up here. I 
Where the heck am I supposed to go? Pretty lin pretty linear linear. I just gotta keep going this way. Unless but I can't definitely jump up there. Oh hold on, I'm an idiot. Figured it out. I was looking I was staring right at it earlier. Should try to get some more oxygen just to be safe and there's something flashy over there all right time for some serious jetpacking all right my jetpack sure wasn't made for low gravity jumping but it doesn't it does help me across large gaps. I found the trick is to space them, space out the burst for maximum distance. If I repeat the burst too quickly, I'll just use up the charge before time to recover, and I don't get very high. Now I have to decide if I want to go back down below for an easy jump or take the exciting and dangerous route. Assuming I gotta go that way. And that's where she came from. Took the exciting and dangerous route. Astronaut Mike Dexter at your service. Got oh, some uh, something else to discover over here. Further samples of the garnet, the granites, garnets, confirmed they are of the Almi almandine variety, common on Earth, but these are atypical. Atypically large. Rock matrix is a metaphoric likely caused by mountain building. Again, suggests an active geologic past for this planet. Oops, that's not what I want to do. Interesting. So, again, is this all in our head? Are we actually on Earth and we don't even realize it? This path led us to a dead end. I guess it was just so we could read this. So, I guess we'll go back down this way. There's something I'm missing again. Hmm. Cause I made it over this way. Ow. Am I supposed to go up this way? I have a feeling our astronaut's about to die here. Uh, yep. Answer is yes. Answer to that question is yes. But no. Okay. Hmm. The other option is go back down that path that we went down before. I mean, going this way is going to help. Because it's a dead end. All I did was find another reading. I can get up there. Can we cheat the system? It's just no. 
Alright, so very carefully. I'm not gonna make that from there. Okay. Nope, dies instantly. I love games like this. No clear cut way to where you need to go. I mean, what, what am I supposed to, wait, what? Did we just cheat? We cheated! Oh, it worked! We totally cheated. I don't know what the right way of doing that was. Oh, good. Wow, okay, that worked. I was about to get royally irritated. Uh oh. I think now I have to kill myself. I don't know how I'm gonna get up there. Okay, that's how. Okay, cool. Oh no! No 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 no! Okay, that's the better way to do it. Finally, we made it to the chasm of death. Now where is our half-naked woman? They're not up here anymore. More that green stuff. And there's her footprints. So she turns the ground green wherever she walks. Interesting. We can finally continue on with our lives. Ooh. Um. Oh, okay. Sweet. We don't have to go on another super leapy jump again. We've got green glowy and red glowy. We can only know what's about to, you know, or only speculate what will happen to us soon. She's got some like tight, tight rope walking abilities and. Mad skill. Okay, so it looks like we need to go over. Oh, so now I have to tight walk, rope walk. Okay, don't look down. Don't look down. Solid advice. Intimidating. We got this though. That was a, make it across these tunnel foam wires. That confirms it. This is not planet Earth. What confirmed it? Is there something I'm missing? I mean, if you thought, well, I guess. Probably better safe than sorry to confirm that it's not Earth before you take your helmet off. But clearly that woman's running around without a helmet, so why do I need one? Unless she's supposed to be some kind of weird mutant. She got she went down from here. I went 
all the way over there. Haha, we're not killing ourselves anymore. This is a successful mission so far. We're on the trail. <clears throat> Sorry there was like a quick break there. I forgot how long I normally run these videos. Um, make sure I don't go super long. I know I'm trying to keep them under 30 minutes, but I couldn't remember if it was 20 or 30. Why? We're determined to find her. Maybe she's... Oh, no, 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 no. Okay. How far back are we being set? Okay, I can handle that. There's a dam. She got off down there too. The title of this game is very misleading. It says Lifeless Planet. Clearly there is or has been life here. <coughs> Contrary to popular belief. Did it boost mode disabled? That's awesome. She went down this way, so I guess we're gonna follow the green path. Oh, too high. Uh, music just cuts out like that. Go this way. <coughs> oh, wait. We got it. Ha ha! On the road again. Tell my friends I'm on that road again. Blah 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 blah. I've already butchered this song. Be on the road again. That was simple enough. Okay. This video may be a little longer than regulars, the others, but I'm determined to at least get to this dam. Which looks like we have. Except there's a gate up ahead. E. Definitely a high speed traveler. Let me see if it does like a load area. Interesting. Is that what I need to do? Oh, water. <laughs> Maybe not using my jetpack. Okay, there we go. Are we cheating? I think, I think we're just being big brain right here. Big brain plays. Aha, but what's over here real quick? That's where, I, back there is where I need to go. Okay, so there's nothing over here of importance. We will find her again. She may be in my love interest. You thought a gate could stop me. Ha, ah, that's a laugh.
That's a lot of water. There should be more plants, though. I would assume, unless the soil is toxic or something. Oh, dead plants. Interesting. So I gotta get up on these rocks. I had a feeling we needed to. It's probably blown up here. Not kill ourselves. A makeshift shelter. Is this her home? We find her home. Let's go see what's inside this building. That's that's just structure pieces. Oh, maybe not. Maybe we won't end here. Can I get up there? Oh, that too high for Junior. Too high for Junior. <coughs> Unless, if there's a will, there's a, yep, knew it. Maybe we won't end it here yet. Ooh, there's a bunch of interesting shiny things. Подвижная механическая рука наконец работает. Мы обнаружили, что... I'm just gonna let the guy speak Russian and uh, let you guys read this. Oh, he's done. Mobile robotic arm is finally working. We discovered that traditional batteries were rendered inoperable within the proximity of the structures. Then a junior technician suggested we use the green fire itself as a power source for the arm. After weeks of work, we finally succeeded. The arm actually draws power from the structures and a perfect solution to the impasse. All the for the glory of Mother Russia. Where is said robotic? Uh oh, what's happening? Robotic arm. Oh, I got a rob. Awesome. Нам очень повезло, что по прибытию на эту планету здесь уже существовала сеть устройств, способных обеспечить все наши потребности в электроэнергии, невзирая на странность их внешнего вида и строения которые мы быстро утвердили как нашу собственность. Однако любопытно, что системы управления для запуска этих устройств кажутся предназначенными для очень высоких существ, mm. гораздо более высоких, чем человек или что-либо, с чем мы столкнулись здесь с момента нашего прибытия. Несмотря на это, наши отличные инженеры быстро придумали оригинальное техническое решение. При помощи этой механической руки Мы в состоянии добраться до самых высоких мест, что дает нам возможность приводить в действие нужные устройства. И все же причина такой высоты этих систем управления остается загадкой. Были ли другие гости на этой планете еще до нас? Или, может, здесь существуют и другие формы жизни, помимо сугубо растительной? Really? So there may be visitors before the Russians got here. Interesting. The woman we're chasing is clearly Russian. Well, I mean, she speaks Russian and then she has a, the Soviet hammer and sickle on her chest. She must have went for a swim. So these are the power. Oh, fudge. She just went for a swim too. Okay, well, that didn't work well at all. Maybe I need to like balance myself across those beams. Green there too. So green fire, which is probably whatever this stuff is. And it seems to be left by the woman that I'm following. There may have been life before us. Before the Russians came. Hmm, interesting. All right. I think this is where we're gonna stop. Looks like we're about to get some interesting things here. Got green glowy stuff. That machine's making weird throbbing noises and that one's electrifying things. <clears throat> so now YouTube will call it an end here and I look forward to seeing you guys into the next video. If you like it, please comment, like, subscribe and share this with your friends. Have a good one everybody.